I'm Luis Martinez. I am a staff physicist here at Lawrence Livermore National Laboratory. Um, and my current area of research is in quantum information science. As a child, you know, I grew up in an urban area, um, East Los Angeles. Um, I am a child of immigrant parents. And I didn't have any role models in science, right? But I always had curiosity. I always wanted to, to understand nature for some reason. It's just been within me to, to, to understand things. I actually didn't take my first physics course till I was in my 20s um, in community college. And uh, the reason I took that course was because I had a buddy of mine tell me, hey, you're always reading about science. You're always reading these articles about light. Like, why don't you take a physics course or something? So, you know, and I was like, physics, what is that? So um, I took Physics 21 intro course, and it, which is a survey of all of the field of physics. And my mind was blown away. I, I, so many questions were answered, but so many more were posed, and, and I was just kind of hooked on that. And so um, I always wondered about light, right? So if you take a ball, you throw it at the wall, at the wall it bounces back. And okay, everybody can visualize that, everybody can see that. If you turn on a light bulb, you know, as before I knew physics, you can see that it bounces off the walls, it bounces off things, but I always ask, why doesn't it push the wall, right? You know, you can go all the way from somewhere on theory, you can write it all down, you can write the equations, you can model the motion, and then you do the experiment, set it up, put the lasers, put the cavities there, and it happens. And, and you know, going from all the way from paper to seeing it with your own eyes, that is something that's amazing. And the unique thing about physics is, is that it explains nature at a fundamental level where you can use that understanding, that knowledge, to then develop new technology, right? Because you, you master it, you understand it to the point where you can almost exploit it. So, so I think that is something that's really cool about this.